minute and I have to let you know that this call is being recorded for quality assurance and the reason for the call is to let you know about a special risk-free trial to try and help improve the quality of life for people just like yourself. Now, the good news is one of our partners, a leading lift chair company in America, is running a special 14-day risk-free trial. So just imagine a lazy boy chair, but much, much better. Uh, the chair gives you complete body massage from head to toe and also provides heat to the entire body. Uh, also, the chair lift, it lifts you up into a standing position with a simple push of a button, and you get to try the chair risk-free for 14 days. Uh, there's absolutely nothing to lose because we deliver and set up the chair, and if you don't like it for any reason, we send someone to pick it up, and you take it back for free, so no harm done. Okay. And what I'm going to and what I'm going to do now is bring one of my supervisors on the line to get this all set up with you and go over the rest of the information to let you know how you can take advantage of the 14-day risk-free trial, okay? Okay! Please stay on the line while I transfer us over now. He's going to transfer So me. how's the weather out your way today? It's warm out. For once, my bones don't hurt. Your call is very important to us. Please stay on the line and you'll be transferred to the next Yeah, I, I can't complain. Uh, really, the weather in Florida is always beautiful this time of year. And I look forward to speaking with the senior sadist. No problem. This will only take a couple minutes and I'll go extra quick for you. Okay. Hi, Dan. This is Mary with the Americans Lift Chair and the reported line. Hi, this is John, and I have a qualified candidate on the line who would like to learn more about the risk-free 14-day trial for the lift chair. Can you please help them from here? Sure, John. I can take you from here. Hi, Darren. And who do I have the pleasure of speaking with? Robert Grinnell. Okay, and how is your day going so far? Well, I woke up this morning, and I read the obituaries in the newspaper, and my name wasn't in there, so I'm grateful. Oh, okay. Well, that's amazing to hear. But I just hope you enjoy and have a wonderful, amazing day to you as well, okay? Okay. Okay. Well, Robert, um, let me just start off by saying congratulations on your free lift chair trial. You're, you're going to love this chair. Just let me tell you a little bit more about this incredible chair here, okay? Okay. A lot of people have told me that if I keep doing what I'm doing, sooner or later I'll get the electric chair. I'm sorry? I look forward to uh, getting this electric chair. Oh, okay. All right, well, now the next step is just to let me gather your information so we can safely get the chair out to you then, okay? Okay. Okay, so can you spell your last name for me? My last name is spelled G as in golf, R as in Romeo, I as in India, N as in November, N as in November, E as in Echo, L as in Lima, L as in Lima. Oh, okay, and can you spell your first name as well? My first name is spelled R as in Romeo, O as in Oscar, B as in Bravo, E as in Echo, R as in Romeo, T as in Tango. Oh, all right then. And um, what is your date of birth? I was born a poor child, Christmas Day, year of our Lord, 1942, when I was born, the Battle of Stalingrad was still raging in Russia, and it was Franklin Roosevelt's third term in office. Okay, so it's the 12th to 25th, 42, correct? Uh, December 25, 1942. Yeah. My mother said <laughs> I was a kid. The 12th month, the 25th day, 42 year. Yes. My mother said I was a Christmas gift to the world in the middle of a world war. Amen. Wow. Your mom was right. Yeah, hopefully. Okay, and do you happen to remember your social on the top of your head? My social security number is 027-24-1-1-1. Okay. And what is your address? 
What is your street name and number? My address is 4550 Calhoun Street, Unit 13, Dearborn, Michigan, 48126. 48126, okay. All right, and are you currently working on Social Security Disability, retired, not working? Oh, I retired over 10 years ago, so I'm, I, I'm retarded now. You retired. That, oh, so it's relaxing time now, huh? That's right. When I turned <laughs> 65, I told my boss I was going to retard, and now I'm retarded. Oh, no. It's not retarded. It's retiring to um, relax in time. When you get to be my age, retired, retarded, it's the same thing. Oh, my, oh, my. Okay, then. And, um... Well, I have some great news here for you, Robert. I have successfully verified your information and you have been approved to try out our list share. So I'm gonna bring my supervisor on the line with us now and they'll finish up with you just to let you know when the chair will reach you and all those information there, okay? Okay. All right, and you don't have to worry because I'll introduce your you to that. very important okay? to us. Please stay on the line and you'll be transferred to the next available agent. All right, then. So how was the day over there today? Is it okay? Is it wonderful? Well, thankfully, it's warm out. So for once, my bones don't hurt when it's cold outside or it's raining. My bones hurt. You don't want to get old. Oh, okay. Well, if something like this chair would be your great help, then. Works with the full body massage and heat. Or will, it, will it really help you out with those full... Um, um, pains that you're receiving, the, the full body massage, it will smooth it away. And just to say, if you're having difficulties getting up, the chair reclines you as well. It lifts you up to your feet and it goes all the way back down. So you won't have to struggle in getting up or hurting yourself while getting up as well. Yes, I look forward Thanks to for sitting on the chair. I look forward to sitting in the chair while watching reruns of the Golden Girls. Your call is very important to us. Please stay on the line and you'll be transferred to the next available agent. It's, oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Go ahead. It sounds like the secret agent is very busy. I sound like to someone who is very busy? Yes. <laughs> no, no, I'm not busy. I'm just making sure that all your information here is correct because we don't want to make sure we don't want the chair to send out to the wrong address. So uh, I'm just making sure that everything is here is correctly. Oh yes, and Mr. Robert, you also have um, three different fabrics you can pick from for the 14 days. You have a dark brown leather, a tan plush cloth, and a gray plush cloth. Which one would you like to try? Do you have the color blue suede shoes? No, Mr. Robert. All the blue is all out. All the oh. only colors we have are the dark brown leather, the blue, I mean the tan plus cloth, and the gray. Your call is very important to us. Please stay on the line and you'll be transferred to the next available agent. I guess I'll get the gray chair. When you get to be my age, you no longer see the world as good and evil or black and white. You see it in shades of gray. You see it in shades of gray? Yes. Oh, okay. And do you like to take some walks? Do you like to go and walk in the evening, stuff like that? Well, sometimes when my bones don't hurt too much, instead of taking the senior van to uh, go to bingo, sometimes I'll walk to bingo. Oh, so you're stretching out them legs and getting a little exercise. Yes. Hey, this is Don with America's Lift Journal Recorded Line. Sorry for the delay. No problem, Don. It's Mary here, and I have Mr. Hey, Robert here in the line as well. And he has been approved to try out our lift chair. Can you please get him all oh, set up I from here? That. Yeah, I'll take it here from here, Mary. Thank you, Mary. You're welcome. Yeah. Hello. All right. Hey, Robert. 
Hello, Robert. Yes. Hey, Robert. How are you? My name is uh, Donald Moore, and it's M O A R. Please just call me Don, and I'm with America's Lift Chair on a recorded line. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? I am not too bad. Thank you very much for asking. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm just looking at the notes here. Um, I really like what I'm saying. Congratulations on your risk-free lift chair trial, okay? Robert, you're going to love this chair. Yes. Um, and, um, yeah, and... Yeah, for years people told me if I keep doing what I'm doing, sooner or later I'll get the electric chair. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> it is electric. It is electric. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, that's funny. How's your day been so far, my good man? Well, I woke up this morning, and I read the obituaries in the paper, and my name isn't in there, no, so I'm grateful. <laughs> oh, man, I hear ya. I hear ya. Holy smokes. Uh, are you still at 4550 Calhoun Street, Unit 13, Dearborn 48126? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Calhoun, that's a street, right? Yeah, good. What do you got planned for the weekend? Oh, when you get to be my age, you don't have many plans. If I wake up tomorrow morning, I will probably go play bingo. Oh, you like bingo, too. I like bingo. Yes. Where do you play? Oh, in the uh, basement of the senior center. Nice. Good. How long have you been doing that for? Oh, I've been doing it for years and years. Nice. Good for you. I'm just looking at all the notes here. There's a lot of notes. Mary said she really enjoyed talking to you. Oh, thank you. She really you. enjoyed talking to you, so, yeah, so, perfect. So how the uh, risk-free trial works, okay, Robert? Uh, we take uh, a, a fully refundable deposit of $99, okay? Okay. From there, we deliver the chair to your home. Yeah, we deliver the chair to your home, set it up in your room of choice, okay? Uh, you don't lift a finger, okay? Now, the 14-day trial does not start until the day the chair actually arrives inside your home. We want to be crystal clear on that, okay? Okay. Now, if you decide, yeah, if you decide for whatever reason, Robert, during that period that it's not a good fit, you don't want to keep it, it's not for you, um, we come right back out, pick up the chair, refund the $99 back to you on the spot, okay? Okay. All right. Uh, Robert, what type of chair did you want to try for the risk-free trial? Did you want the uh, the dark brown leather, the gray suede, or the tan suede? Which one did you want to try? I'll take the gray because when you get to be my age, you no longer see right and wrong, <laughs> good and evil, black and white. You just see shades of gray. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. And uh, Robert, do you uh, do you have a pen and paper handy? I just want to give you the customer service information. Okay, my uh, pen and paper is uh, upstairs. It'll take just a few moments to get it. You move a bit slow when you're 79. 79. <coughs> 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 Excuse me, that happens every time I mix beer and wine. Just another set of stairs. All right, let me check in the drawer. Okay, I got my pen and paper. So I got my pen and paper. Hello? 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 Hi, this is Mary from American Senior Citizen Care. How are you doing today? I'm okay. How are you? 
great. Good to know that. I'm doing great. Well, I'm calling you just to inform you about a new state-regulated final expense insurance plan that has just been approved for senior citizens who are on a fixed income, like Social Security, Disability, and Retirement. This plan is designed to cover 100% of your funeral, burial, and cremation expenses. So I have one of my state license coordinators available right now who's ready to provide more information. How old are you? 79. Great. Let me bring the state license coordinator for your state on the line to share information with you. They're going to connect me to the licensed communist. Okay. Sometimes they play Chopin. Yes. Hello? 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 Hi. Hello, sir. Good morning. This is this call is regarding to the new Medicare Advantage plan. There's a lot of new benefits that you may qualify at no cost. Do you have Medicare or Medicaid? I have Medicare. Okay. Great. Please stay on the line while I'll transfer you to our agent specialist in your state to get your additional benefits. Is that okay? Okay. Okay. Hi there. Thank you for waiting. My name is Maria. I'm a Medicare help agent. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you. Um, I'm here to see if you qualify for additional benefits through Medicare. Now, what I, I'm going to do is just ask you just a few questions and then find a licensed um, representative or agent in your zip code area. I'm just going to ask you just a few questions. Okay, sir? Okay. Um, now, I understand that you have Medicare Part A and B. Yes. I understand that you have Part A and B. Of you do? Okay, great. Alrighty, and um, what is your zip code, please? Four eight one two six. Great, thank you so much. And your first and last name? My first name is Robert, and my last name is Grinnell. 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 So it's spelled G is in golf. Okay. Do you uh -huh. need the spelling? Sure. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> so my last name is spelled G is in golf, R is in Romeo, uh -huh. I is in India, N is in November, N is in November, E is in Echo, L is in Lima, L is in Lima. It's the same spelling as the college in Iowa or that of the bird expert who oh, died yeah. in 1939. Sure. Okay, great. Thank you, sir. And, um, Mr. Grinnell, I am going to play a uh, recording. The recording's basically just um, telling us that you're going to also share the same information <coughs> that you shared with me with a licensed agent in your zip code area, okay? And if the call drops, that uh, we can call you back. Once you listen to the recording, I'm going to go ahead and um, transfer you over to that licensed area in your zip code area. So um, just answer with a yes at the end, okay? Here we go. We're going to play the recording now. Okay. We take your privacy seriously. Before we transfer you, we need you to acknowledge that by saying yes, you agree to share this same information with the licensed insurance agent who will further assist you, and you agree for them to contact you via telephone, mobile device, or email, even if your phone number is listed on any state, federal, or corporate do not call list. I have them on the line. Do you agree to these terms before I transfer the call for that free quote? Yes. Okay, thank you for that. Yes, Mr. Robert. Hold on one second, please. Okay. Your call is being answered by the <coughs> next available agent. Thank you for calling the nation's leading enrollment center for Medicare supplemental options and Medicare Advantage plans. Whether you're looking for more complete coverage, a better rate, 
or adding supplemental coverage to your existing plan, we have you covered. Our agents are licensed, trained, and specialize in finding you the right plan at the right price. Enrollment is easy. All ages are accepted and approval guaranteed. We're sorry for the delay. Your call is important to us, so don't hang up and we will be with you momentarily. Hi, Mr. Grinnell? Yes. Uh, Mr. Grinnell? Yes. Okay, I have the agent on I have the agent on the line now, okay? Thank you, sir. Okay. Hi, Robert. Good morning. Good morning, Robert. This is Jose on our recorded line. And Robert, before we continue for compliance and your awareness, this interaction is not associated with any promotional or monetary value, okay? Okay. Perfect. Now, if I'm correct, your zip code is not from Kansas, Robert. It's from Michigan, right? Yes. Oh, there was a little mistake on the transferring because I am in Kansas. So I did a connection with a license agent from your state who is going to assist you a lot better. Let me just introduce you so you don't have to repeat everything again, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm so sorry for the delay. It seems that the light... Oh, here it is. Let me introduce you. Thank you for choosing select quote. This is Patrick Brown on a recorded line. Uh, Good morning. This is Jose. I have Mr. Robert Carmel on the line with the zip code of 48126. His age is 76 years young. May you assist him with his Medicare review, please? Hello? How you doing, Robert? I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing great. Again, my name is Patrick Brown, and I am your licensed sales agent in the state of Michigan. Today, my goal is to make sure you're getting the most out of the Medicare upgrades that you are entitled to, as well as addressing any and every concern that you have, Robert. Uh, with that being said, Robert, do you have parts A and B? Yes. Okay. Um, and what do you currently have, Robert? I have Medicare Part A and I have Medicare Part B. Do you have anything in addition to your Medicare Parts A and B, like Humana, United Healthcare, Wellcare, anything like that? No. When I wore a younger man's clothes, I was too busy spending money on alcohol and drugs and prostitutes and lottery tickets, and I never worried about that until now. Hey, looks, uh, if you do have parts A and B, um, that makes you eligible for plans that also give you dental, hearing, and vision at no extra cost as well as prescription drug coverage. Okay. You um, have that Medicare card handy, Robert? Oh, my Medicare card is upstairs. It'll take a few moments for me to get there. You move a bit slow when you're 79. Okay. So, so I'm climbing up the stairs. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, that happens every time I mix beer and wine. Just another set of stairs. Let me dig in the drawer. Okay, I have the Medicare card. Let me get my reading glasses here. So my Medicare number is 1, E as in Echo, G as in Golf, 4, T as in Tango, E as in Echo, 5, M as in Mike, K as in Kilo, 7, 2. And date of birth, Robert? 
I was born a poor child, Christmas Day, year of our Lord, 1942. When I was born, the Battle of Stalingrad was still raging in Russia, and it was Franklin Roosevelt's third term in office. Okay. Um, do you normally handle your own? Do you normally handle your own Medicare? Um, yes, I've been making. Or is there, is there someone that, that helps you? I've been making my own decisions ever since I fired my caseworker, Mo Lester, and ever since I fired the law firm of Shyster and Shyster. Okay. Before we discuss your plan options and with your permission, I would like to check your eligibility status. Your status will help us determine what plans you may be eligible to enroll into. Please note that the status is based on current information available and is not guaranteed. CMS will make the final determination of eligibility if an application is submitted. Do I have your consent to check your eligibility status? Yes. Okay. Read that um, number back to you. I got one Echo George four Tango Echo five MK seven two. Yes. Doesn't come back matching any uh, beneficiaries at this moment. Oh, I uh, don't know what happened there. Hello. Hello. Yeah, good morning, sir. With American Benefits, how are you doing, sir? I'm okay. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Dad, good, sir. So this short call is about final expense insurance plan. Dad is to 100% for your final expenses. How old are you, sir? Like, uh, what's your age? I'm 79. Okay, sir. Not qualified. Have a nice day. Bye. I'm not Bye. qualified. How old do I have to be? What's the cutoff age? But I could really use this. I thought with most plans. Hello? 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 Sir, I'm Sophia calling you from Senior Healthcare. How are you doing today? I'm okay. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. This call is about Medicare Part C and D, where you can get additional more benefits without any additional cost to you. So do you have your Medicare Part A and B, correct? Yes. Okay, so with our help, you can get more dental, vision, hearing, and transportation coverages for yourself. So how old are you, sir? I'm 79. God bless you more with a good health. So do you make your own medical decision at the age of 79? I've been making my own decisions ever since I fired my caseworker, Anita Bath, and ever since I fired the law firm of Shyster and Shyster. Hello? Hello?